Hello guys, this is Ryan and as I said to you about the military series, the recruitment tip series which I will be continuing. So this is the second episode for the series. I have compiled a list of 10 most important things. In your anchor of this channel, I am presenting you top 10 most important things which you must know before, during and after meeting the military recruiter. Before joining any branch of military, you must watch my episodes. I have covered tip 10 to 8 from my in my previous video. So this will be the continuation. So I will be continuing with the 7th. The coming next tip is number 7. Take the EST. The test or enlisted screening test is sometimes referred to as ASWAB. A -S -W -A -B. So in the French Foreign Legion Army, ASWAB is considered like an aptitude or psychometric test. So it is one of the most important factor to know. Different branches of military may call it by different names. So S test is a kind of test which is orally written. You know, it is like a writing test which happens when you meet to the recruitment, military recruitment. When you go to the French Foreign Legion and then you gonna meet to the recruitment and he gonna make a, a very little test. It is called S test and it is to determine whether you are capable to give the as well or psychometric test or not, you know. If you score in those tests, this test is just very personal, it is not for scoring. They just need to know whether you are capable of giving the psychometric test on computer and continuing with the army. This test will give your recruiter an accurate idea of what, how you are going to be doing, of how you are going to be doing it as well or psychometric test and it is one of the most essential tests. Okay, maybe it is not considered, the mark is not considered till last. But this is the written test which the human resource recruitment person gonna take and this will determine your scores, you know, this will determine your future and uh, whether you're gonna be continuing for the upper tests or not. Uh, the S test uh, can be completed in less than 20 minutes. Uh, the S test is designed to know whether if you should be given chance or not, okay, for the further psychometric test. So tip number six is be honest to your recruiter. Being honest, you answer your recruiter. Enlisting in any branch of the military requires a thorough background checkup. During the enlistment process, the recruiter is going to ask you a lot of questions about education, previous residence, employment history, law violation, personal references, medical history. The most important of the question is law violation and medicals. Okay, These two things are going to determine your future and selection in the process. Many applications are denied or temporarily rejected due to failing to disclose certain items in these two key processes. By doing your part, you understand that the enlistment will go smooth, you know. If you're being honest with them and you say the particular things, it's gonna be smooth. It will allow your recruiter to concentrate on other aspects. Now let's concentrate on tip number five. Get the basic training. See, if you prepare, the basic training is one of the most essential factor and it's gonna give you a professional feeling, you know. As if you have been done before, you you won't be average anymore. You will have to, you will sound really ready-made, you know, as if you are ready-made and your recruiter gonna like you because you are a ready-made soldier, physically able and there are many, many places in which you can actually do the army training, army practices. Getting prepared will make you look good among all the other candidates and you're gonna be above average. Be being proactive in the process of basic training you gonna give idea to your recruitment you gonna demonstrate the type of soldier you want to be so in this basic training you know once you do the basic training and you are really good in the farm training and all the six months and then you understand you know that the time comes when they gonna question you in which regiment you want to go so the Gestapo gonna ask you or the captain you know so you can decide your own career you know you have you can decide whether you want to be in rep, reg, ray it, it's all depending on you, you know, infantry, cavalry, whatever. So, why not score better and the person who is really like, be prepared and who take the tip seriously, they want to be definitely on the top and the people who are able and who concentrate on the suspects because we live life on rules, you know, if there is rules, there is life. So, the people who get selected in candidates, the people who get selected in military or other areas, but definitely they have a lot of calculations they do everything good they are properly trained so in this channel we take the professional help i'm just an anchor who is trying to demonstrate the ideas of a proper recruitment being an anchor it's my duty to give you the professional education about the military career and uh, military is definitely for not for everyone it is 
for only for one percent of population who wants to be in there, who wants to save the country. Uh, in the next episode, we're gonna explain you more and more series. Do subscribe this channel, like it, and this way you will get more and more information every day. Take care, Sayu. Bye bye. Thank you.